starring moment. My name's Matt, welcome back to the shop. And uh, <laughs> someone, I just thought we'd do a bit of a different thing. I have, this is a sofa, if, um, yes, I have a sofa in my garage. Uh, why not? <laughs> Fuck it. I say shed, it's a shed. It's just a big shed. It's not even a big shed, really. It's just a shed. It's a nice shed. I like the shed. Slowly getting there, moving stuff around. You'll see this plate and stuff. It's actually uh, um, the exterior for a, a test piece of equipment. The test piece of equipment died, and not mine. And I've salvaged these because they're great panelling to make something out of. Um, any road. So, what's this fucking video about? Um, so, two things. People keep on sending me videos about a particular thing. And I want to highlight something else. And the only reason why this video exists is because this is important, right? This is a lot of the reasons why I do these videos are... I would say the channel's 50-50. One part of the channel is to explore, explain, explore, talk about, discuss, analyse, blah, blah, blah. Engines engineering bikes right it's to do that side of things it's what you'd call it education in a way education discussion about a topic um with some more hand movements and it's to do that with a bit of humor chucked in a bit of entertainment value stuff like that so just say like doing the Project Isaac bike, or doing the SV series that I'm fucking slugging through, or other stuff like that. The whole point is, is to make it, uh, to cover all bases in a sense. So if people, you know, if it's, it's quick just to slap, 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 and it's done, which is what a lot of other channels are doing, which is fine, I want to go through and say, right, let's stop here for a second, let's calm this down. This here is like this for this reason. Let me explain this scenario. And there are other ones. I can briefly talk about them, but we don't have them. We will get round to them ones, and I'll show you the opposite. So in a, in a sense, over time, you end up getting a wealth of knowledge by being hands-on. Because the thing is, these are videos. You can't touch these things. You can't pick them up. You can't be nosy. So I try and show as much that comes to mind. And I miss shit and stuff like that. That's one side of the thing. The other side of the thing is the anti-node to that. The other is the things that fly in the face of that. So, misinformation, people call it fake news, whatever. misinformation, it's not fake news, it's misinformation, um, mischaracterization, outright lies, bullshits, and then stuff like that comes into scams and um, just general fucking rubbish. The other thing that's a part of that as well is people say to me, I could do a video saying, oh, this is this is dangerous, right? Prove it. Oh, what you, what you, what's your proof? What's your statistics? I don't know. Common sense is the proof. But it's not the proof, though. That's the problem. All right, fair enough. So then what I do is I then... People then send me stuff and I go, look, look, this example, this example. And I always like to go back. If I find an excellent example of... People been fucking idiots. For instance, Brian from Fat Brian from Chase on Two Wheels. Um, he might have the luscious big workspace. He might have all the shiny tools. It looks good. He's got all the kit. He's got all the gear. And then, not one occasion, not two occasions. There are several occasions. And you've got to remember, right? With the power of media, with the power of media, with the power of a camera. You can edit shit out. Like, you didn't know there's a can of Pepsi Max here. Not sponsored. You know what I mean? You didn't also know there was a lithium battery here. Or a screwdriver. Or a phone. <laughs> you get my point, right? You don't know what's behind the camera right now. There's a bottle of turtle wax behind the camera because I'm setting that up for something else. I'll prove it. Oh, no, sorry. That's teacup. And then there's some turtle wax so I didn't even lie didn't even lie twice <laughs> um, you get what I mean is it's like you don't know what's here 
And what's down here? You especially don't know what that is, right? It, you will see it, but um, you can cut stuff out, right? You can cut stuff out. You can hide stuff. You can fucking break something. Wait for the part to turn back up a month later. Put it in and stitch it together like oh, a massive video. You don't know when I... Well, you will know when I record this video because I'm about to say something that has a date that says 30th of March. But you don't know when, where, who, how long, what mistakes were cut out. You don't know anything. So, um, the transparency of these things to me is very important, right? And, it, you know, it, at the end of the day, it's just videos, right? Entertainment with a bit of this. Um... And people love seeing people are scamming people have it stuck to them. <coughs> people, you know, and it's like the whole tank chip thing with the hot. It, it, there's loads of them. They're sold by M and P. They're sold on Google, Amazon, fucking you name it. They're sold everywhere. People won't stop, right? If there's a scam there, if they can get people, if they got people before, uh, one's born every minute, an idiot, and one scammer's born every fucking five minutes. Um. So that's that. Some people get the second part of what I do wrong, right? They're like, you want to see an idiot? Here's this idiot. And, you know, like, they'll say, oh, I'll just say the names. You'll say, oh, you, you think Dell's a fucking idiot? Here's the silly builds. Look at what he's doing. Now, Vasily has now come out with a new video saying, ah, yeah, we're looking for a new engine because I think this one might be tossed. That... I don't care if that's because I drew enough attention to it by doing a video. Enough people went to him and said, look, that engine's probably fucked. You're best off leaving it. I don't know if he came to that himself. I don't know if he spoke to someone and they said. I don't know if it was other people's comments. I don't know if it was my video. It doesn't matter. I don't want the lad to fail. And he needs to go and get another engine, right? Because otherwise he's going to put all these parts and money into something that he's going to go kaboom. And it could kill him. It could hurt him. It could just cost him a lot of money because it just revenue and just grenades itself. The fact of the matter is, is I don't want him to hurt himself, kill himself, kill anybody else, hurt anybody else, waste his money, waste his time, waste his effort, and I want him to succeed. That's the whole point of those videos. Um, he's different from Dell because he has got that little cheeky, cocky charm, but fucking, we all did at that age. Um, the fact of the matter is, is that he's younger, right? So you can't give him a bit of leeway going, you know, he's fucking younger. He's just fucking young, dumb and full of cum kind of thing. And that's fine, right? So I didn't hammer the fuck out of him. Um, but with the Dell thing, right? So this is what I want to get to because it's the hang-up that most people have. But it's like this. You watch a Brock video, right? Brock releases a video once every six months that's fucking got something really dumb in it, right? Really dumb in it. He'll do like five videos on five videos every six months, ten videos every six months. Who cares? A lot of his diner runs, and he might say something that's bullshitty in there, but it's not worth an entire video anyone's attention, right? He's just bullshitting. It's fine. But then he'll do something like he'll laugh the fact that some guy lost it at the drag track, and five seconds later would have been fucking paralysed or dead. Stuff like that. It is fucking fuck. It's his fuck up. Pl plucking out fucking O-rings in chains. Just shit like that, right? It's just amazing. And the gems are falling off the ground, but they're once every six months, right? So, you've got that. And there's other people like Jake the Garden Todger. We're going to get to his fucking bike lift. <laughs> you got Jake, and then you've got him, and then you've got Chase on two wheels, Brian, just fucking stuff up. But... I asked people to send me the clips because I haven't got the time to go looking through them all. And it's more just to... It's, it's not policing. It's, I'm not stopping anyone doing anything. Keep them fucking going. It's just... It's funny how I do these videos where I say something and then instead of most people being defiant, they, they don't mention it. And I'm fine with that. They don't mention it. They just go, oh, yeah, we decided completely unrelated to do this instead. I'm like, well, fine. Don't matter. As long as you're now telling people that, that's all good, right? That's all fucking great. Like that wankers who are fucking putting fr welding frames up in the most dodgiest way you've ever seen and then f putting filler on it to cover it up. Fuck me and selling them on eBay. Fucking hell. They seem to have not done any more videos, which if I've nuked that, good, because that's just fucking dangerous. Or they're doing it, they're just not putting it on YouTube. 
what can I do, right? I'm just drawing people's attention. Be careful. Keep your wits about you. But a lot of these people don't realise what they're doing. You know what I mean? They don't, I need a new frame. I fuck my frame. They just do racing. They're very good. You know, they're very proficient riders. Don't know what they're doing. You know, is this good? Is this bad? Well, I'm giving you examples of what's bad and why, right? That's the best I can do, really. I can't answer every single question. And I don't know the answer to every fucking question. That's the other thing. Um, but people say, oh, this guy's like Adele. Not Adele the singer, like Adele. And I watch it and I go, no, it's, you, you're missing the thing. Because the thing is, with Adele, right, is that he, he's just, it's like this. If Imagine you've got three slot machines, right, or ten slot machines, or a fucking casino full of slot machines. You put a quid in that and fucking now and then it shits out 20 quid. But that one over there, you just keep, you put a quid in and it gives you 20 quid. You put a quid in and it gives you 15 quid. You put, every time... You, you fuck off the rest, right? You fuck off the rest, and you stay on that machine until it stops. And it doesn't stop. That's what Dell is, right? Dell is this constant supply of dumb. For instance, would you believe that after he knows that everyone's hawkeyeing him, because I've done all these videos over X amount of years and stuff, blah, 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 that he'd do the hot coolant thing. It was almost like he was baiting me, apart from he took down the video, which means he was being serious. Um, who would have thought? Who would have thought? Who would have thought? The little bits with the Harley engine, I don't care. right? You know, If he says it's this and it's this, it doesn't matter. If he says it's that, it just makes him like a prick. If he says it's this and this, it doesn't matter. When he starts recycling filler dust, that's just funny. right? That, people need to see that. That's just hilarious. Um, and so on and so forth. Someone sent me this, right, saying this guy might be, you know what I mean, is this guy, you know, Adele. Not Adele the singer. So I've got it in front of me, right, so this is a guy, um, his channel is called, and as soon as people hear it, if you've seen it, you know what I mean, his channel's called Re-Motorcycled, so it's like recycled, but between the re and cycled, there's the word motor between it. Uh, he's got 390 subscribers, 930 subscribers, sorry. Uh, In-depth videos following my motorcycle build progress, slightly unhinged. That's cool. He's got 72,000 views in total. And he's put up quite a few videos, actually. I fucking hell, quite a few. Shitloads of videos. Um, actually, shitloads of videos. And... He looks like he's just trying to do the honest, the honest YouTube way, right? I like the honest YouTube way. His first video was three years ago. It's got 91 views on it. Poor sod. Um, I haven't watched anything but all these, right? Um, this title might sound... Oh, my light's gone. Let me sort the light out. You might think to yourself, why don't you put the light lights on? The reason why is when I do, it looks like I've got leukemia. And this is a lot better. <laughs> um, where was I? Yeah, so, uh, you see the lights? The lights you don't see. Um, yeah, so, I haven't watched any of his things. It just seems to be, he's not clickbaiting it. Or anything. How to make uh, a, what is it? He's doing a glass fibre mudguard, a carbon fibre mudguard. I haven't watched it. Let me quickly just skim through it. Uh, he's a jock, so if you don't like sweaties, it's not for you. What's it come out as? I just want to have a quick look. And see how it comes out. Uh, he's doing it like a lot of people do in the shed at the bottom of the out little outhouse or whatever. That looks lovely. <coughs> he's done not a bad job on that. A lot better than fucking Dell did. So, um, I would go and check out his channel. Uh, it's uh, I'll put a link in the description of this video. I would go and check it out, just to go and see. You know what I mean? Give the guy a... Uh, just give him a view, right? You know, go and have a look. Go and have a look and see what he says and stuff like that. Um, he's even got a CAD model. Oh. Um, any road. So, yeah. Basically, he's doing this uh, XS750, and, uh, well, this happens.
Oh, you stupid cunt. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, well. So, as you can see, um, that's quite awesome. I am going to leave this video pretty much here and say just check out to see what happens if he puts it out or not. I will say the difference between... The big difference between Adele and him is that Dell will... We'll just use the coolant one, right? Dell will take that coolant out for no real reason. He won't explain what he's doing. It's just words on the screen. He does all this stupid music, all the multiple camera shots, shit like that. He just says this is the way to do it. This is the way to do it. It gives the reasons why he's doing it that stupid way. Burns himself, but doesn't fucking say that. Uh, just puts an exclamation mark saying, caution, it's very hot. Like a fucking retard. And he also just says, that's it at the end. That's it. Nice, quickly done. Right, easy fucking sorted out. Um, oh, oh, that made it easy for you. See you later. Fuck off. Ride safe, right? Up, drain it out. Flush it through with a couple of passes of distilled water and then fill it with your chosen coolant. Now I haven't mentioned anything about any particular coolant today because this translates to any vehicle, even your car, and the various different coolants for different vehicles. Pick the right one for you or whatever you prefer. Simple as that. What I wanted to promote today was the procedure. It's ever so easy. I think the tools involved today was a screwdriver and a pair of pliers. Job done. It wasn't got one of them. So there we are, a very simple straightforward coolant change on your liquid cooled motorcycle or whatever. Hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching. Take it easy. Ride safe. I'll see you next time. That's what he does. Where this guy at the end's like, I know I'm a retard. Start again. So I think I got off um, pretty lucky with that. That was had a, a I guess ten minutes to let my nerves settle and have a wee think. Um, I'm a retard. I've not got a fire extinguisher handy or even in my garage that's really poor planning i was rushing i know what i did wrong it scared the fuck out of me you know what i mean i need to do this i need to do that should have done it outside blah 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 blah, blah. and i i do say to people if you're doing any kind of fueling system because you're at the end of a build usually do it outside do it if you can do it outside or just make sure you've got a red friend with you um but is that's the difference his honesty at the end was this is my fault i fucked up we're gonna call it what did he say he says we're gonna call it something we're gonna call it the fire starter um he is it, i'll just read his description his description starts out firstly it was an accident obviously but holy shit, that was a terrifying experience uh, on the drive to get this bike started, I've, I may have skipped a few steps in the process, which led to a much higher risk when working with a combustible element such as, say, petrol. I wasn't thinking straight and didn't observe a leaking fuel ball that pissed fuel all over my starter motor. When I went to make a connection with the starter motor, the arc from the cable caused a massive spark, which subsequently caused a fireball in my shed. I don't have a fire extinguisher, idiot, I do now. Uh, so a bit of a time was spent flapping trying to get a hose sorted. Luckily everything is okay. Uh, well, appears to be. So I managed to get lucky uh, to get a lucky escape. Lessons well and truly learned onwards, right? And he even says the action starts from 21 minutes. <laughs> so he's even give people a skippable bit. Uh, you know what I mean? If you like what you saw, please subscribe. Stay updated. If you didn't like it, please subscribe so you can continue to get updates and pick holes in my work. Fucking love this. Right? More regular updates. Blah, 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 blah. And he's given his Instagram and stuff like that. But one of the things, like I say, it says in the video title, it's not clickbait. I set my bike on fire. He fucking did. <laughs> he just did. Um, so go and watch the video. It's just a recommendation of mine. Um, but that is the difference, right? That is the difference, is that there are people who go, oh, fuck, what have I done? Oh. There's a video someone sent me recently of a guy, can't remember names, I'm shit with names, he has a really old, rare dirt bike with magnesium cases, and he's trying to get the cases apart, and he busts a chisel through the side, a punch through the side of it. That was actually really quite dumb. Um... You know, people going about me fucking breaking fins. That's a rare bike in the side casings that are now completely fucked. 
you can get that welded, but you need to take it if someone really knows what they're doing, because it's magnesium alloys as well, so they're twats. Um, well, they're not really that difficult, but you have to take it to someone who knows what they're doing. Don't have a go yourself. Just don't go, I'll get some of these Aluma rods and just fucking have a go. Um, so, yeah, you know what I mean? Um, I was greatly entertained by watching that, and I was very. I went from just another bike building series. Okay, let's see where this goes. Let's see. Ooh, ooh, ooh! And then there was fire. And then afterwards, I was at the end of it. I was laughing, going, "I really like this guy." So I am going to subscribe right now and put the alert bell on for all. I will watch these videos, and I suggest that you just at least going to give it a look. Uh, link in the description to his channel or this video, one or the other. And hope that makes sense. And me and Red here, we'll see you in a bit. Fucking looking at you, cunt. Dropping. Every time. Every time. Right then. Nearly forgot. One thing I want to add. Fucking hell. One thing I want to add on the end is that um, I am starting to premiere videos. So there's a lot of. There's, I say there's a lot of guys. There's about 50 guys who like to converse in the comments, they like to chat away. Like a video will come out, they'll watch the video, they'll say, blah, 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 Matt, you're a knobhead, cut your hair, you're fat, blah, blah, blah. And then they'll say, ooh, I know some of the Yorkshire twat was fat, and then they'll start talking, there'll be these big threads. YouTube do a thing, which is called, for me, which is called Premiere, which means that I can put the video up, it's like a really, it's like a film premiere, 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 pre whatever. One of them things. So it's a screening in a sense. So you watch it. It's almost like you're watching the video live. It's a bit weird. Um, but basically, the video starts and there's a chat at the side. So you can literally sit there and chat amongst yourselves. I am going to set... I've been fucking around with it. I'm going to set the preview thing. So you'll get... Um, I'll set the preview thing an hour, right? So an hour before the video comes out so the video will just say come out at seven I'll, i'm gonna try and do them all for seven o'clock so the video will start at seven it it just plays and you can watch it or you can watch it later on you know what i mean it's, it's not like you can't watch it you can either i think you can also go back it's just the video will be released at seven o'clock so an hour before that from six onwards there will be a link to the video and there'll be a live chat, so you guys can chat away, talk about whatever. Sometimes I go in there. When the video starts, I fuck right off, because I can't be asked to watch myself again, because I've just edited it. Um, it doesn't cost anything. It doesn't blah, 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 blah. It's nothing like that. You can just sit there and all chat amongst yourselves about whatever. Um, I just think it's... Why not? It's a feature that's free. I have to do a t click a few things, but that's about it. And then there's like a countdown and then the video comes on when it's like two minutes or one minute before the video. Who fucking cares? It, you can just turn up for the chat for a bit and you, people can chat during the video. And I think people can keep on chatting for a bit after the video. I'm not entirely sure about that bit. It's all new to me, but I'm trying that. Um, the other thing as well is people have been saying, Matt, I'd love to subscribe to the channel, but I hate Patreon. I think PayPal is the enemy. Blah, 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 blah. So there is a new thing. Uh, let me find out what it's called. <laughs> uh, memberships. So there is a thing called memberships. I don't know how you get to it. It'll probably be on the video or on my channel or something. Basically, you pay a membership. I think it's two ninety nine. I went for the lower one. Um, I don't know. Membership level. Yeah, so it's two ninety nine, and what's it offer? I can't remember now. E oh, early access to new videos. If people, I, I won't bother. But if people do sign up, I will start releasing some some videos. Not every single video. Some videos, like a day or two early, something like that. Whatever. Uh, what is it? It, it, it's like this. That is a way. I think it's per month. That is a way that you can you can become a member of the channel. It means that you get members only live chats, which we will be doing. Uh, you get a priority in comment replies somehow. Your comment goes to the top somehow. <laughs> Don't know how it works. 
Early access to new videos, membership shout outs. Member shout outs, we could do that. Yep, I've got no problem with doing that. Um, but that's there's only one. You can do tiers, and I was like, oh, I don't want to fucking do that. I don't want to start hierarchy bloody knobheads. If you know, if you want, that's the way you can go around. Um, it, it's just a flat rate. It's just two ninety nine a month. I think. I'm not trying to get money out of people. Or you can go and get YouTube fucking premium, and then some of that goes to me, and you help YouTube survive instead of fucking depending on adverts. This is just, I'm not trying to sell anything. This is just options. It's there. I signed up to it. I had to go through all this bullshit to sign up to it. It's there. You don't have to. Everything won't change apart from people might get access. Well, people will get access to some early stuff. And there will be a chat that I do where I think there's a thing on here. You press it and go members chats. Um, uh, recent comments. Recent videos, recent activity. There's something you can I can press to do a chat. I'll do a chat thing where members can talk to me on a certain date. <laughs> Live streams. I'm still. <laughs> I've got. I'm like this. All right, I've got so many things to do. There's so many things. Um, milling machines, compressors, sandblasting. More engine stuff, more cleaning, more lights. I've got these fucking bloody baton lights. To, I've got more. I want more, more. I want so I want control. So I have two light switches. So it's one light and then fucking extra light because of filming. It's so much easier when you have extra light to film with. We've got vacuum pumps. I've got to post up. I'll do it next week. I've got to post up the Halloween, Christmas, Easter special because there's toolboxes to give away for fuck's sake um, and memes to go through. We've got cross section, blah, but there's just. I'm, I'm literally on it. I'm on it like hot shit. There's loads of stuff that I'm actually ploughing through. Uh, as you know, the videos are just. It's editing that takes so fucking long. I'm editing two videos right now. Any road? Enough of that. Go and see the guy's video and stuff. <laughs>